bitch is pure evil. I think she's sweet. Really? Well, then why is she giving my girl laxatives? Why are you going through my back? It's all part of being a mentor. What is this? Hmm? And don't tell me it's because the cafeteria food binds you up. Those are, like, from months ago. I forgot they were even in there. The pretty little liar gave them to her. I can sense it, thanks to my psychic Mexican third eye. See, this is what my psych professor calls projecting. You're projecting Kitty onto me. Santana, we've graduated. It's really time to get over this. Get over what? You being jealous of me. And why would I be jealous of you? And please don't tell me it's because you're in some lame, secret Nazi sorority. Look, homecoming weekend, I went to Jodie Foster's clam bake. And that professor that I was talking about, well, he's 35, smokes a pipe. Well, he's divorcing his wife, who hasn't touched him for three years. And I'm dating him. Wow. Twitter update! <laughs> Quinn is all excited about another guy defining her life. And what are you excited about? Shaking pom-poms in Kentucky? I mean, you want everybody to think that you're such a badass, but really you're just a scared little girl with low self-esteem who's too frightened to chase her dreams. Did Professor Patches teach you that one in between quickies on his office couch? Does he get so turned on by teen moms who barely visit their kid? <gasps> oh, what are you guys doing? Nothing. Nothing at all. Quinn always was a genius slapper. <laughs>